My name is David Polson and I'm a community ambassador for the Bobby Goldsmith Foundation. I was one of the first 400 people diagnosed with HIV AIDS in 1984. Suffocatingly terrifying. I felt that I was falling down an endless, bottomless black pit. It's because then, A, it was a death sentence, and B, there was so much fear, hatred, and discrimination against anyone who had HIV AIDS. You would see your friends sick and dying in hospital, and the thought couldn't help but pass into your mind, when will this be me? But I said to my doctor, okay, I will do anything to help you find out more about HIV. So, and I did, from that moment, I did study after study. That's how I got involved and that's how I stayed involved. Unfortunately, in many people's mind, in our community and certainly other communities, HIV AIDS is a thing of the 80s and 90s, which is a great shame because HIV AIDS is still here. There are still people living in poverty as a result of being uh, HIV positive and having sicknesses, suffering stigma and discrimination. Bobby Goldsmith still provide that same feeling of support, love and care that they did when they first started back in 84. So that's a pretty amazing thing to have that ethos at the beginning and to keep it going and actually grow stronger. Uh, when everyone else is um, maybe not quite so interested in HIV AIDS, Bobby Goldsmith still is. They're still caring about people who have HIV and they want to make their lives different for the better.